What's up guys? How are we doing? I hope we're all well. And as you can see we're back more Animalica. I am absolutely loving, loving this game at the minute. Um, I am watching all the tutorials that are out for Animalica. Actual Animalica and the... Ah! Animalica themselves have brought out certain tutorials that are on YouTube at the minute. Fantastic what I think might be coming to the game. Um, so, but it's been a very hot one today, so I've got the fan on. So if you hear a bit of wind noise um, coming through to the microphone, it might be that. I've tried to put the microphone in a place where I'm not going to get too much interference so but yeah so I have been on and done a little bit of off-camera stuff I've been and um, just been and had done, done a bit of um, foraging around shall we say and uh, been and collected some um, herbs and stuff like that so what I want to try and do today is I want to try and see what we're gonna need to build the um, the deer enclosure because I think um, that is what's going to be coming in to the game. I think they're going to bring in that they have to have food and they have to have water. I think that's what's going to be happening. Um, I'm not sure when it's going to be, to be honest. Um, there's chrome over there. So I will take you into the <laughs> also guys I don't know I found some stuff <laughs> which you can probably see over there can we see can you see what's in there I just found all this stuff that you can just randomly pick up here yeah. oh what's happened to me rug look but, so yeah, we have a little area here now where we can sit, but we can't. It's all it's all decorated and stuff. Look, it's just pretty easy to take. But I reckon, I reckon we can use the axe and break it up, or a hammer. That's what I'm. That's what I reckon we can do. So I'm not sure about this. It might just be, but they might just be decorative plants. Um, but so yeah, that's what I did basically. Um, so now we've got, um, yeah, we've got 50, 58 timber up here. We've got firewood. Um, we've got ninety-five metal scraps, sixty brick, one hundred twelve nails, sixty-five bolts. Um, so we've got stuff in there, we've got, now we've got stuff in here, see look, we've got more, more metal scraps and more nails, more bolts, so we've got them, we've now got, I think there's stuff up here as well, yep, more wood, more nails, so we've got plenty, well, I say we've got plenty, I don't actually personally think we have got a lot. Um, over here we now have all of this stuff which we need for um, making stuff. Oh, I can make trench cars around us. That's rather handy. Um, so yeah, so this is the crate we're going to use, and this is going to be the corner we're going to use for all the, all the plants and that that we find. I've decided I'm just going to pick everything up when, when we're full. We'll head back to base. Simple as that. Um, and was it this one? 
yeah, look, we've got the animals. Because I also, while I was out, I actually managed to get a couple of rabbits as well. But until we can get the cure potions done, then um, there's not much we can do. Um, but I filled it with water. We've got plenty, plenty of stuff to eat here. We've got potatoes and stuff, so we should be pretty good. But yes, the deer enclosure dies. Um, it's over here. We have on the basic workshop. We can make. Um, buildings, you see. Um, oh no, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. But yeah, we can do look barns, large barns, long barns. Yeah, but wooden shack. You know, simple building. It can be used as an animal shelter. So I'm wondering whether or not we should make. A wooden shack and something like a maybe not a pavilion um, but yeah there's fences and Look, just look. <laughs> but yeah, look, feeding troughs. You know, large water trough, right? So we need bricks, cement, and a water pump. Or we can just have a normal one here, which is a water pump, nail, and timber. So we can do these. See, for a grass feeding trough, large stone, plant fibre. And timber. Yeah, we can probably do all these. To be completely honest, we could probably make some of these. But look, I'm also wondering whether or not they're going to bring in um, so you can put down set down grass and stuff like that as well but uh, yeah I mean look here looks like a little animal shelter look just like that timber and cloth chicken I haven't seen any chickens yet but they're gonna, obviously they're going to be coming in so so that's what I've been just trying to roam around the map, just trying to trying to get um, pick up plants like that. So you can read. Um, then you can just walk straight through walls. And fine, I suppose. Um, but yeah, so we need dandelion. We need that as well. Um, but all this stuff respawned. This weren't here when I was just running around before. So the plants do grow back, but and these trees, if this, if they're not green at the top, then we can cut um, cut them down. So, but yes, in here. Um, is it this one? Is this the deer enclosure? Oh, that's the zebras. Deers are over here, that's right. Yeah, because what I've been sort of looking at... See, that dog grows just right in the way of that. So they have, they have already over here got some stuff but this is useless this really is useless so let's see if we can
break it up. <coughs> Does it give us anything if we can? The trouble is you have to do this for so long sometimes. And I think people give up way too easily. I think when that action is happening and that noise, I think something is going to happen. Maybe I need a hammer. Maybe a hammer would be better there we go and that give us nothing by the looks of it oh no it gives it uh, give us an animal shelter but that didn't look it didn't look like it was going to do anything, did it? Let's see if we can make something different. The axe. Right. The axe obviously did something. So the hammer is definitely better for the natural enrichment, so we might as well leave that there. We'll take the anti there up. Right, so we've got water. <laughs> See, that fence is broken. Can we move that as well? Right, so let's go back and get. This is where it would be handy if we could have a workshop in every area. <laughs> right, so we've got all this cleared up. See, there's a dead tree there. Let's chop that down as well. right side sometimes there we go <clears throat> so let's see if yeah 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 there's another tree over there we don't need these here they're just not doing this any favour at all But the large stones and stuff like that all in the ground, they're adding to the um, to the natural enrichment. We'll leave all that because that's all fine. That's that is natural enrichment. That's absolutely fine. What about that tree over there? That looks that looks pretty dead to me. Logs. Right, let's go over and let's make something for the deer enclosure. Uh, 
Um, let's not go that way to do it, because it's down here. Sorry guys, sometimes something will just pop out at me and I'll go, ooh, hang on. See that? Yes. So we can, we can mine everything, but in here, I mean look, you see, you've got natural enrichment. It's like a palm tree. And we've got the two big trees in here, which we could take down and put in there for shade. that another broken water pump so that must add to um, so look at all this stuff it's laying about again don't know why I made him a dog house I've never used it right so let's Let's see what we need to make um, uh, to make a one too far, haven't I? Alright, let's just say a wooden shack. Right? So we need. Oh, we need cat tails. We definitely haven't got any of that. How about that one? Oh. I didn't realise we need cat tails. Oh, hang on, I think. No, there we go. Right, where's the cat? Where can we find cat types? We need to go out hunting again. Go scavenging, scavenging more stuff. We could probably build a fence. Oh, I mean, look at it. Oh dear, oh dear. I don't really know what any of these are for either at the minute. Right, cattails. Where on earth are we going to find cattails from? Right, let's have a little wander about. There is somewhere we haven't been. I've realised we have not been here. Press E to ascend. R to what's that doing there? Oh, there is stuff hidden about here everywhere. So we haven't been up here. So you never know what might be up here. 
but I do need to find out where we can get some cattails from. Ah, this is where the wind turbines are. And not much else. Aha, oh I know where we are. Hey! There's stuff I missed, look. What's in here? Empty bottles. I can always have empty bottles. That's handy to know that's up there, though. All these little places where we can um, go and store stuff. Right, now this is a bit of a tedious journey, guys. All the way over here, and it's not for much, to be honest. But I do know there is something over here that I require. Cattails. I wonder. They normally grow near water, so. Well, that's what I how I can imagine them. You know, when you think. I've seen people play um, Long Dark, for instance. And they eat cattails. So whether this is the same kind of thing, because if it if it is, then we need to go to somewhere where they've got where it's water based. And I'm just wondering. See that coming soon. But in here we have arrows, which I do really really, really need. Really. Oh, they're trank arrows. Um, and empty vials. We've got plenty of them now. But yes, I needed the trank arrows. But yes, so this is all coming soon. And I think... Um, I think this is the dome part and if I'm correct in thinking the only reason you need a dome is to stop things getting out so what do we recognize what do you reckon is going in there leave me a comment let me know what you think might might be going in the dome right let's see if we can run back go on So we need to find cattail. So I think um, yeah, I th think I might have to do some research before I go and do that. So basically, what we've done today is just gone over and check out the we've been to check out the dome today that's what we've pretty much done so at some point we are going to um oh go out there we need to sort out the deer enclosure but i'm presuming that it at some point they will bring it in to let us know what animals require what enrichment so we can, you know, get it all sorted out. So it's, it's um, it 
so we know what we're doing, basically. Um, let's just pop over here. Right, what we got in here now? We've got more bricks which we can put away. Do I have any nails? They said that they. Yeah, you see, now I think you can you can put more nails. And bolt. Timber up there. Logs up there. Um, want anything else in that scraps? More rope? Um, not in that box. <laughs> Sticks are over there, but I think that's another hundred lot. Yep. Right, that's cool. Now we need to go and do that one. And put in the more metal scraps, more sticks, and but we are getting quite a collection here, guys. Bandage, matches, we need all that. Um, Toolkits we need to keep on us. Cool, cool. Right, let's go over here and let's offload all this stuff. Um, we've got chicory. Just down there. Dandelion. Now a gold. There. Oh dear. Get plant fiber, we've got 16 of them now. Oh, great. And. Right. We're going to have to use another book. We'll use one at the back there. Start putting these in. Um, there we go. That is actually done. Animal shelters and fences. I'm wondering if they've been can be placed, but can they be repaired? This is the thing. Anyway, I think that's going to have to do us for that. I'm going to do some research into. <laughs> look at that. Gonna do some research and um, see if um, see if I can find out some more about where to find the cattails. I think before I do my next episode, that might be a good, very good idea. Might be a very good idea actually. Uh oh, what was that? Okay, drink. Four. That'll do us. Right, lovely job. Uh, let me sort that out. There we go. We made a room as well. <laughs> but right guys, uh, that's definitely going to be it from me. So thanks for watching. Um, I'll bring out another video very, very soon. And I will speak to you all next time. Cheers for watching guys.